Who are you voting for and why? Uh, John Kerry. Uh, I just feel like he's more presidential, he's smarter, he has a grasp on the issues, grasp on reality, which I definitely think George Bush does not. Um, I think the last four years have been really awful for America and for most of its middle class and lower class. And I don't know, I just think it's time for a change. I think, I think Bush didn't win the first election, so he certainly doesn't deserve to win this one. You feel the same way? Yeah, and I already voted for Kerry at yeah. the ballot, so. You feel the same way he does? Yeah, I just feel like George Bush is just, I don't know why he voted him, so. I think Kerry can do a better job than Bush. Thank you very much. You're You've already voted. I okay, voted. and who'd you vote I for? I voted early voting, and yep. I voted for John Kerry. Okay, and why? And my vote was not so much, I'm not Democrat and I'm not Republican, and my vote was not so much just for John Kerry. It was more a vote against Bush. Why? Because the economy stinks. We're getting all these people killed. We had no business going to Iraq. We should have been spending all that money going after the real terrorist, Bin Laden. I can't even think of his name now. I'm just frustrated with the whole mess. So if I had a choice... Does she feel the same way? No. no. Oh, and you don't, oh, and for that reason she, you, she doesn't want to say anything. I don't know why she doesn't. She just doesn't, but I don't mind telling you. Okay. I mean, it is. It's a right. free company. Everybody has the right, and I really don't like the choices, period. Okay. I'm going I'm to be voting for uh, George W. Bush. I think uh, given the, the situation he's, he's been handed, he's d done a fantastic job. Also, uh, I just don't believe that Kerry could do the job. I think uh, he does whatever he thinks his audience wants to hear and says whatever he thinks is going to be popular. He hasn't really stuck to anything. And as a senator, I don't think he's done that much in the past 12 years. I don't know how long he's been a senator. So that's why I'm voting for Bush. I don't, I don't want to vote for either one of them. Why? Neither one of them are telling me what I want to hear. What about Nader? <laughs> what about the Libertarian? No. Um, I might just skip it this year. You just might? Yeah. Let's go vote for the sheriff. Okay. Just because you feel that to cast your vote I don't trust be... either one of them. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't necessarily think that Bush has done a bad job, but I don't like the the way the deficit's been run up into the trillions, and I don't trust Kerry. I just, you know, he, I just, he still hasn't come out and said to me what, he hasn't told me what he stands for. He's made a lot of noise, but that's it. So, I might just skip it. I've already voted. I live in Oregon, so I've already sent my ballot in. All right. And, uh, and who'd you vote for? Kerry. Okay, and why? Because I can't stand Bush, and Cheney, and Rumsford, and... And Ashcroft, they are just, they are big money, self-centered, and everything else, and I don't want my grandsons to be going off to war. And I have them where they're reaching the age that if they go through the draft, I'd like to go. And I'm just appalled by it, absolutely appalled by it. Okay, I'm going to vote for President Bush because I think he's a strong leader. And he's strong on security, which is the main issue. If we don't have a country, the other issues aren't even an issue. Um, he's honest. The other candidate isn't. Um, and he says what he means, and he means what he says, and he does what he says. So we can depend on him. Okay, who are you voting for? John Kerry. Why? Why? Because I want to see assault, be assault weapons stay off the street. I'd like to see the, the health care system be worked on. I really disagree with what Bush has done with foreign policy and alienating the rest of the world. Um, in general, I think Kerry's a much better candidate for president than Bush is. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, I'm going to vote for John Kerry. Uh, number one, I'm a Democrat, but number two, uh, the guy who's been in there, George W. Bush, is probably the worst president we've ever had. And what scares me the most is the fact that this guy has the possibility of, a, of uh, appointing not one, but maybe two or three Supreme Court justices, which is going to impact this country for decades to come. And whatever you think is wrong with the world now is going to be more so in another 20 or 30 years. It's just this guy needs to go at all costs. I'm voting for George Bush. I just have confidence in the way he's handling the war, even though you know I'd rather that we weren't involved. And I think he's better for business than Kerry. And we are 
business people. And you don't have no confidence in Kerry? No. Can you explain why or um, what is it about him? I think he's wishy 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 and I more than Kerry, I really don't like John Edwards and knowing he's a heartbeat away from the White House, I don't have confidence well, in why voting is it, for why, why do you, why would that be scary that John Edwards? To me he seems like uh, my impression he's it's like uh, a Hollywood event. It's hard to explain, but I, I don't see him as a um, strong leader. I just see him more as a personality rather than a leader. Well, I'm independent because everyone changes so often, so you end up sticking with all of your own beliefs. Um, I, there's a lot of rigmarole going on in this one. A lot of who did this and who didn't do that. But. Um, I think I'm going to stick with what's going on and what's been happening. Um, Mr. Bush, I mean, President Bush, um, as well as he's done, and a lot of people are against the fact that we're in Iraq and all of that, but if you look at how many more unopened graves they're going to find, you know, of people that have been ruined by all of what's going on out there. And, yeah, there's a lot of focus for in here, and I think that he's done a good job for that. I think Mr. Kerry's great, but um, I think some of why I don't want him to be is because Hulbert Ave is going to become a gated community. <laughs> so I don't like that idea. And how about you? I can only see what everybody else votes because I can't vote because I'm not a citizen. But if I were to vote, I also am an independent person myself. For right now, I think that President Bush is getting a lot of unnecessary harassment I feel because I feel he did what he could have done to the best of his ability um, as far as what went on with the Twin Towers and whatnot. If I feel that if he had not done something, prevent, I, I feel if he had not gone to war as we did then the U.S. would have been on top of him just, just the same and been like, why didn't you do this? Why didn't you retaliate? Um, I think that uh, everybody I think it's pretty understood that John Kerry right now is going to say anything he wants to say to be president. the next president. And I feel that anything that, I think everybody look right now is looking to get out of Iraq. And so obviously he's going to say, let's get out of Iraq. So it's, it's a, little hard to, a little hard to judge on that, but good luck to both. Yeah, good luck to both of them. <laughs> I wouldn't want that job. <laughs>